what's up people it's your boy ricky ross back with another video i uh, want to say thank you out there to everybody that's been uh, watching my video subscribing to my channel i truly truly appreciate it thank you so much uh, for those of you out there who don't know who i am i go by ricky ross amazon germany seller been doing this for quite some time i also do mentor quite a few people uh, if you're interested, my email will be in the description down below. Thank you. In this video, uh, we're going to be diving or talking about the Elster registration, how to register uh, through the Elster. Uh, so for those of you out there who don't know what the Elster is, Elster is basically uh, a platform that you use to communicate with the uh, German uh, tax authorities called the Finanzamt. So basically, if you need to send them information uh, such as your tax returns or even uh, request a tax ID number or request a VAT number, you can do uh, this through the Elster. Now, there's quite a lot of things you could do through the Elster, but before you could do all those things, you need to register first with the Elster, and it's a process. Uh, and that's what we're going to go through, the step-by-step -step process today. Um, so basically, you first of all go to their website, you um, fill out all the necessary information, and then they send you a what's called certificate uh, info, uh it's a file okay they don't send it to you you download it now you download this and after you download it they send you a code in the mail and once you get that code through the uh post office mail uh you now come back to your elster Put in the username which you use to um, register. Uh, insert the certificate. Upload the certificate, and then put that code that they sent you uh, through the mail into the system, and then you're able to log in. So we're gonna go step by step uh, through it, uh, and I hope this helps uh, someone out there or a lot of you out there uh understand and also hopefully uh do reg do your registration through the elster there are a lot there are lots of things you could like i said you could do through the elster but this is just the uh part where you just register that's what we're focusing on so come along with me we're gonna jump right into my computer hey guys okay welcome to my computer awesome so now you must um, go to elster.de portal and it should bring you here right here uh, so I'm going to leave it in German uh, so you can either click on the Benutzer Konto erstellen here uh, either here or here either one is the same thing so you click on that and it brings you here where they explain to you okay Every other website that you go to, normally you, you need a password and login de and a password and username to log in. But here they're telling you you'll need a what we call a certificate data, uh, a certificate um, data. Uh, this certificate is not like your university certificate or school certificate. It's just a piece of a uh, file that you download from from them. Okay, so just click Vita here. And once again here, they just uh, go through the explanation of the whole process here. Just click on next here. Okay, cool. So here they're asking, uh, what are you using a PC or a laptop? So we're using a PC. So we just click on select. Okay, so here they're asking, are you doing this registration for yourself or for somebody else? That is if you're an organization doing it for somebody else, but it's for MISH. So click on for MISH and click on VITA. Okay, then now they're asking, how do you want to identify yourself with us? Uh, <clears throat> so here they're saying with your Steuer identification number or and 
the store identification number is usually the number you get once you register uh, with uh, the, um, gosh, the rat house. Yes, once you register with the rat house, you normally get this letter. Okay, once you're in Germany and you register, or you move anywhere, you, you get this uh, registration uh, letter. So we're gonna click next here. Cool, so here <clears throat> they're asking for the email address. So we're just going to put our email address there. So put the email address and uh, date of birth. Uh, I'll just put it real quickly. Uh, just putting anything here random. Let's say 99. Okay. So <clears throat> let's see, is that correct? Okay, the format should be. Okay, we're gonna. Cool. Cool. And then the next thing we do here now is the identification number. So you should have your identification number because that's the only way they're going to know um, that it's you that. Uh, is actually doing this application. Cool. Then here they want you to put a username. Um, I usually like to use my email address as my username, but they say maximum eight uh, digits. So I'm just going to put John Doe for now. Uh, <clears throat> now here they're asking for a security questions book. Yeah. Ah, here. Was ist Ihr Lieblings uh, Tier? That's what's your favorite animal? Uh, so here you could just write whatever animal you like. Okay, and you put the answer here. The question is here. Okay, and then the answer should be here. Okay. Uh, and for those of you out there who don't like it in German, you can always switch it to English here. But I just wanted to do it in German so you can follow along. Uh, <clears throat> So uh, basically, um, here they're saying you need to confirm by clicking this box. Okay, so once you've <clears throat> once you've put everything that you need to put in this particular uh, section, and you've put your answer, you've put everything looks good, and you of course check this box to confirm. You need to click next. That's Vita. So uh, here. Uh, <clears throat> you need to uh, basically check everything here, make sure everything looks okay. Uh, and the next page is going to uh, basically the, here they're just telling you um, what to expect. Okay, you're going to get in the mail and in, in the in the post office mail. Is what I'm talking about uh, a letter with with an activation code. Okay. So you're going to need that uh, letter with the activation code. Then here, they have a question here where uh, do you need, uh, it's called an ABRUF uh, code, uh, some code. This is only if you have uh, a tax software, uh, but this is usually for a tax consultants. They would be the ones to check this box uh, if they need this code. So for you, you don't need this code, so don't worry about it. Don't check this box. Uh, they're just informing you. So if you if you're a tax consultant, you obviously know what to do here. Uh, so the next thing you'll need to do here is to check it. That's proven. So the next step is click here. So here you would check and make sure everything is correct. Once you see everything is correct, you got your email address correct, your date of birth, your identification uh, number is correct. Uh, so you'll just need to send. And once you send this, uh, you will get a confirmation email. Okay. And that's what uh, I'll show you what you'll get next in the next. You should get a verification email to verify your email address. Next, you'll need an activation ID and an activation code. The activation ID will be sent to you per email, and then the activation code will be sent to you uh, through your post. Go back to the email and click on the registration link to start the registration process. Enter the ID and code, and then click on App Sending. 
Next page is where you create the certificate. Create a really strong password and enter it twice. You can skip name the certificate that I, then click on Einstellen to generate the certificate. Once the certificate is generated, download it to your computer by clicking on certificate here on Taladen. Make sure you keep the file safe on your computer because you'll need it along with your password to log into your Elster account. Select the certificate by clicking on the blue button right there that says do so can put the password in and click on login. It should bring you to this page where you log in for the first time. You need to put in your personal details, enter your details, save the details and click on the next page. Uh, on the next page, you'll select the private person and click on Viter. You may see a short message from the Elster. Simply click or check the box to acknowledge that you read it and then click on Bestätigen und Weiter. That will get you to the page where you'll see the different forms. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. If you have any comments, if you have any questions, please uh, drop them in the comment section down below. I truly appreciate it. I try to respond uh, as much as I can. Once again, uh, it's your boy Ricky Ross. If you are interested in my Amazon mentorship, please, uh, the my email will be in the description. Send me an email and I'll send you details about that. Uh, please like this video, share this video, uh, send it to anybody that might need to see it uh, and hopefully it might be able to help them out. I truly appreciate it. it once again, it's your boy Ricky Ross. I'm out. <laughs>